guys. I know that a lot of you are wondering uh, when you see a BMW, what is this uh, red thing here under the rear view mirror? So <laughs> it is pretty simple. Uh, I don't know if a lot of cars have this uh, option, but um, this little red dot here, also named the Rudolf nose, it used to notify you that uh, the car is locked or unlocked. So when you have the your key, you lock the car, and immediately after that, after you you lock your car. You will see this uh, little uh, LED. And it will blink when I lock the car. And if you leave it like this, we're still watching. It's blinking now, once a second. So um, it has uh, another function. As you know, you can lock the car and not start the OEM alarm in it. So how do you do that? And when do you know that the car is locked without an alarm? And when do you know that the car is locked and you have the alarm on? So this is now, let me show you like this. Okay, so this now the car is locked, okay? Click it again and it shows that it's locked unlock the car and now the blinking will stop okay you have to unlock one door and then close it now when you lock your car and then in the next few the next five seconds you push the lock button again you will deactivate the alarm function so let's do this one and again and that LED just showed you that the alarm is off and now you have a locked car but with an alarm off to activate again the alarm you have to unlock the car unlock the door so it knows that you're leaving the car then lock it and click it again and now the car alarm is on and it will start blinking again Okay, let me show you a little zoom view of this blinker here. Okay, so this is how it blinks one second apart. Okay, so hope you enjoyed this video. It's a pretty pretty simple one, a pretty simple thing to do. And if you ever notice that you can um, open your hood and your alarm won't start, it's because it has been disabled. So this is a pretty simple uh, thing to to enable it again hope this helps see you in the next one